very much, Richard. So as we're um, bringing our NANOG conference to a close here, we have some concluding comments with, uh, from Dave and uh, Betty as well. Is Betty, uh, is Betty available? Betty around? Oh, there she is. Okay. There we go. All right. Well, okay, so uh, NANOG 53, someone was asking me this morning what the first NANOG I went to was, and I didn't really realize that they had numbers that low, but it turned out, <laughs> it turned out to be NANOG 4 back in 95. It was at Merritt, or at, in, Ann Ar in Ann Arbor, at, uh, you know, at, at uh, UMish. It was really something. It's worth looking at, it's worth going back and looking at the, um, sort of the agendas for those meetings. It's kind of humorous to see what people were talking about. For the most part, the same people are talking about the same thing. <laughs> that kind of stuff. So, all right, so I want to do my thing so I can let Betty go. Um, I, I, first off, I want to thank Comcast for hosting. Let's give them a big hand. <laughs> Great job by Comcast. Now, and, I, and we have a, a, a you know, we're... I'm going to do Betty's slides. Right okay. Yeah, okay. I'm getting pushed out. I'm getting the hook already. Um, uh, we had a great, a great number of great other sponsors, breaks, um, breakfast, <coughs> excuse me, breakfast, all of that. So let's give our all other sponsors a hand. <coughs> so I'm also thinking about, you know, we just did the, as all you know, we just did Nanog elections, and I wanted to call out a few things here. Um, first off, the board of directors um, of Nunog, now Nanog, did a fantastic job in supporting us, so let's give them all a hand. It was really easy to work with them. They've, uh, for all of those board members who are in here, um, keep doing what you're doing, which is leaving us alone to do the um, agenda. Um, I also want to call out Steve. Steve, stand up. Steve was, uh, <laughs> Steve's terming out as uh, chair of the board. He, and as you know, he guided all us through all of the, uh, uh, you know, initial process of this, but Steve's been around here, I think, longer than I have, and so I have a lot of, um, I mean, a lot of the history and uh, knowledge and culture of Nanog has grown up with Steve here. Now, we also have a program committee who puts this all together for you, and I wanted to call out the names of the people who are either terming out, not standing for re-election, or who are up for re-election right now, and that would be Kathy, CJ, can you stand up? Um, Jim, Jim Cowie, is Jim in here? No. Uh, Barry Green's not here. Mohit, I think maybe, oh, Jim's there, okay. Um, Chris Morrow, um, Dan, Donnie, and Sonia. Okay, well, these people are the people who brought this, oh, there's Sonia back there. So they're the people who brought all this to you, and um, again, we just did the elections, and we're gonna appoint the new PC later on, but consider running for one of these slots. I'll s yeah. Yeah, I'll just, I'll, just, I'll just say it's tremendously satisfying when you get to stand up here and look at, you know, 500 of your closest friends and you know they're going to have a good time. It's, you know, it's worth, it's worth doing. Um, I also wanted to thank AMS, which is the conference management um, company that's helping us put on NANOG now that Merritt's not doing it anymore. Kristen, Kristen, Annabelle, and Bettina have been working really hard to bring this to you, so thank you to those guys. And then Steve and the Verland, Steve and the Verland crew doing the networking and stuff back there. Thank you, Steve. Uh, let's see, what else do we have? Um, speakers, hey, the speakers were great. I thought the program came out pretty well, and I, I really want to thank all of the speakers who took the time to build the content, come out here and give the talk, so thank you. And then the final thank you is going to have to go to all of you folks for coming out and making it happen. So thank you very much for coming to the NANOG. We really, we really, I think all of us who are working on it are very, you know, get a lot of satisfaction out of bringing this to you. So thanks. Okay, so now, now the hard work. Um, so we're going to have the call for presentations up for, San, for the San Diego meeting, hopefully by the end of the in next, early next week or the end of this week. So everybody start thinking about talks, tutorials, tracks, whatever you want to do, because uh, San Diego is not all that far away. So with that, I think I'll just hand it over to Betty. Just thanks again, everyone. Thanks, Dave. I'll, I'll be brief. Um, 
Again, I echo what uh, Dave just communicated, which is there are a lot of folks involved in putting together the meeting and the program for you. And uh, I want to thank all of them, from the board members themselves to the entire program committee to all the contractors here and the hotel staff. Great job, and truly to Comcast for coming forward and hosting a hosting us again for the second time and all the sponsors it's it's really been uh, a team effort on a lot of fronts my job is to share with you the results of the election process before I do that I wanted to just give you some highlights of the meeting uh, we've prepared some stats in terms of the number of folks that were here and from what regions we will as we always do, publish a much more detailed list of statistics. So this is just a real brief summary to give you a feel for how the meeting turned out. Number of countries, again, just the top, but there I believe were 30 some or something, I'm not really sure, um, in the top organizations. And by description, just to give you a sense of the uh, population that was here. And again, welcome NANOG 54. As we close NANOG 53, we are now already preparing to support you in San Diego. And I also want to just take a moment before I announce the election results and honor the memory of one of our missing colleagues. You will have seen earlier on the projectors, perhaps, and on the panel out front, some pictures of ABBA. Ahula. Um, she was really important to a number of us and to the internet at large. Uh, she passed away 10 years ago, so we like to take a moment and just honor her memory. I also encourage anyone who feels strongly enough and so committed, there are two scholarships um, available in her memory, one out of NANOG and another out of, I believe, AFNOG. So we'll put links up, and if you want to learn more about ABBA, um, in her contribution or to enable others to follow in her footsteps of engineering, it would, you know, be great. Um, my real job here uh, to, is to, in closing the meeting is to announce the election results. We will, they should probably be posted now if you go to the NANOG 2011 elections page, you'll get the detailed results. But I'm happy to report that all four board candidates have been elected to the board. <laughs> the bylaw corrections, the uh, work that others, Steve, primarily did in helping us to correct some of the language from the early adoption has also been approved. And the um, section of the bylaws where we dealt with the committee restructuring of the support committees has also been approved. Um, so that's the election results. Um, the program committee, as Dave indicated, will be the next set of tasks for the new board to appoint and uh, get started on NANOG 54. With that, um, unless we have questions for Dave or myself for the board, we're gonna close this meeting. Thanks again. Enjoy your day. Oh, that's right, because I didn't want to forget to uh, thank anybody. But of course, I forgot to thank Betty. And Betty's been running around doing everything. So thank you, Betty. Now we're done.